Hi, my name is Pauline Reed Wilkerson, and I'm a proud immigrant to the United States of America. My story is of an ordinary girl raised by an extraordinary mother. My ancestors were dropped off in the Caribbean as opposed to the Americas, specifically the island of Jamaica. Slavery ended in the early 1800s in Jamaica. Like so many, my ancestors were concerned with education and the betterment of their children, so immigration became a way to get off the island and a chance at a better life. Options at the time were Panama, Canada, the U.S., and the United Kingdom. Jamaica at the time was part of the British colonies. Jamaicans had served in World War II and were familiar with England, so they felt comfortable answering the call when England was in need of rebuilding their country, which translated to many jobs. My mother was excited to set sail with dreams of working hard, saving her money, then returning to her beloved island one day building a house and providing shelter and stability for her family. After she crossed the Atlantic, which she said was thrilling, friends made during the crossing formed a strong community to help and support each other. It didn't take long for their culture to start clashing with the British people who were also fighting to build their futures. They started to marginalize and make people of color feel unwelcome, denying them good jobs and housing. Then came the name calling. She returned, some returned home to Jamaica, but my mother stayed and toughed it out. With my mother encouraging me, telling me I could be anything I wanted in spite of what was happening in our schools. With that said, I went on to realize my dream job of being a flight attendant. I had told my mother at the age of six I would be a stewardess when I grew up at the Heathrow Airport in London. There is something to be said of sp speaking truth to power and putting it in the universe. The stars will align themselves. I'm happy to say I have just completed my 30th year. During my career, I have had the opportunity to meet people from all walks of life. One person I was lucky enough to have on a very short flight was Joe Biden. When he was a senator, you meet him and he will never forget how he make, you will never forget how he makes you feel. how important you are, even as someone who is serving him. He makes eye contact and is fully engaged, not just blowing you off. He flashed that megawatt smile that you still see today. Maya Angelou said, and I quote, people will forget what you said, people will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel, unquote. Joe Biden cares about working people he represented what America means. He represents what America means to many immigrants. Work hard, love this country, and you will have a chance at the American dream. Vote for Joe Biden and Kamala Harris.